Ali Antar who claims to be 140 years old went for surgery to get rid of horn-like growths sprouting from his head. A man who was believed to be the world's oldest man has died at the reported age of 140 after a surgery allegedly went wrong. Ali Antar, from Yemen, had horn-like growths on his head, and went to get surgery in the hope of having them removed. But Alice's family is furiously blaming the operation for his death. Despite claiming to be 140, Ace Age was never officially recognized. Meaning that Juan Vicente Perez of Venezuela, aged 113 years, and 293 days, remains the official oldest man alive. According to reports, Ali died three days after filming a video in which a seemingly untrained person was trying to cut his large growths with a red, hot instrument. A family member said old age was the cause of his death, but added that the primitive way the growths were cut off may have accelerated his death. Alice growths started to appear on his head after he turned 100 years old, Yemeni newspaper Aden al-Gad reported. As they grew, they curled to form a shape that was compared to a goat's horn. Local media reported that. Ali remained in decent health and retained his memory right up until 2017. Then, his health deteriorated. The growths on. His head may have been cutaneous horns which are skin tumors that are made of keratin. They appear from benign, pre-malignant, or malignant skin lesions, and are more common in older patients and people with fairer skin. In some cases, they can be caused by exposure to the sun or other sources of UV radiation. While growths like this can be benign, they can also be associated with cancerous or precancerous health issues. Ali reportedly had more than 70 grandchildren.